Hey guys, Blue, Delta, and we are really excited for this, and we know you guys are too. Um, we've been seeing all the comments coming in following those two deck profiles, and we are a lot are of excitement. So, we are so happy to be finally be doing a big one. So, and I'm gonna start. I'll start with Pot of Greed. Sure. Then I'll set one monster. Set a card and end my turn. I'll draw. I'll set one monster. Make the bull play, hoping you don't have anything of summoning a sound magician level four. And then I will end my turn. All right, you'll draw. This will get a counter for your draw. I'm going to use Tribute, Queen's Knight, uh -oh. for Dark Magician Girl. Uh-oh. And attack your Summit Magician. All right, I take 500. That'll do it for me. I'll draw. I'll end my turn. Bold move. Dark Mission Girl. Attack direct. Stronghold the Moving Fortress, which will special on itself as a 2000 defense monster. Box out. On my field in defense position, right? It comes in defense position. Yes. Providing a nice barrier to my life points. My turn. Draw. Well, I'll leave it at that and hope that you don't have a way through my stronghold. I'll set a monster in my turn. I'll draw. Alright, I will tribute stronghold, the moving fortress, for summon skull. Summon skull, attack dark magician girl. Let's hope there's no mirror force. I'm gonna activate. Black Illusion. Ooh. To the end of this turn, all dark spellcaster monster with 2,000 or more attack. So, yeah, she just qualifies. I control. Cannot be destroyed by battle. Their effects are negated. Whoop to do. And are unaffected by my opponent's card effects. All right. So, you'll be taking 500, and that will even life points up. All right. I end my turn. And before you trigger your Dark Magician. I'll have to be Dark Magic Curtain. Oh boy. I'll do it for you, don't sure. worry. I'll deduct another 3,000 while he's not looking. Dark Magician! Uh, well, my, my prospect of winning this duel may have decreased, but I'm confident my chances are Now, time. that Black Illusion would have really helped this turn. Because you're going to crash Dark Magician? Yeah, I'm going to crash Dark Magician. But Dark Magician Girl will attack with 2300. Exactly, now. 2300. Nice. And then I will end my turn. I'll draw. And then I'll activate Monster Reborn. On your Dark Magician, bringing your Dark Magician girl down to 2,000 attack. Clever. Then I'll Dark Magician attack over Dark Magician girl. Look at that, guys. I had an, a clever answer. Then I'm going to summon a second Silent Magician and end my turn. Silent Magician level 4 goes up. We always had to duplicate some cards in each of their decks, so don't be surprised to see a couple duplicates. He goes up to 1500 attack, or she, rather. Sorry, she. I'll tribute Gazelle. Ooh. To summon Archfiend of Gilfer. Ooh, interesting. To attack Silent Magician level 4. Sure, man. I mean, when you see it, you sort of have to get it off the field. Yeah. Alright, I drop 700 life points. By the way, guys, I'll take this opportunity to just say 
You can check out these deck lists typed up in our deck list document. Most of you know us already. Also, we may play with some erratas. I don't think any of you have seen play yet. We have our errata document. And finally, check out our Facebook. Just all these good stuff to know, guys. My turn? Well, then my turn. I'll draw. And I activate my pot of greed. Then I'll summon Green Gadget. Trying to use as many of the new cards as I can. You saw Silent Magician. Now yes. you'll see Green Gadget, which will add Red Gadget in my hand. I'll try to summon it next turn, guys, if I get the chance. You saw Stronghold. I'll have Dark Magician tag our team of Guilford. You'll eat 300. It'll equip. And then I'll pack you for 1400. Yep. Look at that, guys. I'll set one card and end my turn. I'll set one monster face down. And then summon the Tricky. Then I'll have the Tricky attack Green Gadget. I'll take 600, whoops, dropping me below the 4,000 mark too now. I'll place one card face down and end my turn. I'll draw. Hmm. I'll have Dark Magician attack the Tricky. Will it go through? Yeah. It will. All right, and now we. Uh, I wouldn't. I want to say cleared fields, but the strong monsters have been removed. All right. Well, I will set one spell or trap, and then I will summon Red Gadget. You gotta play around Mirror Force, guys, to add Yellow Gadget to my hand. And then I will end my turn at that. Alright guys, hopefully this is a uh, exciting and tense for you guys because it's exciting and tense for us. I'll end my turn. I'll draw. Mm. Well, first things first. I'm just going to set a monster. Mm. Also, Dread Gadget's defense mode. I am my turn. In a deck with two big shield gardeners, I don't exactly feel safe sending a 1300 attack monster into a face down. Because I would eat 1300 points of damage. And I'll draw. Oh, uh, jeez. Oh, good looks. Forgot about that. I'm gonna dare you to attack. I will summon Silent Swords in level three in attack mode, and just just end my turn. Just leave it at that. Awesome Gazelle, King of Mythical sure. Beasts. Attack, Silent Swordsman. Sure. I'll eat 500. Is it my turn? Yes. I draw. Alright, well, first, I'll activate Gold Sarcophagus. So now, guys, we do have this card errata. Alright, let's put that card out of play. My deck's getting smaller. Oops. And then, Oops, Gandora. I will tribute Witch of the Black Forest for Sound Swords on level 5, which is in my hand. Rutro. Which the Black Forest effect will activate. 
which will add Marshmallow onto my hand, which would be really bad for uh, you to attack and do. Fear, fear the marshmallow. Fear the marshmallowy goodness. And then I will have Silent Swords on level 5 attack Gazelle. Now you've fallen from my trap. Go, Mirror Force. Ooh, drawing it out early. I don't mind that. Well, you don't have much else to use it on, really. Yeah, well, anything bigger I summon. I can't use it on Gandora. That's true. Well, I'll end my turn with that. You both, your Silent Magicians are gone. That's true. Both of level 4s. I don't have any God cards either. That is true. But I do. Special summon is tricky. Some also the monster. And with that, I end my turn. I also need to be careful to keep um, you from getting um, too many uh, monsters. Alright, I'm just going to and hope that he doesn't have a god card. I end my turn. Well, I will tribute all three of my monsters. Rip, guys. It was nice knowing you. And I'm in trouble. I'm in a spot of trouble. 4,000 attack? Yep. By the way, guys, who are you rooting for? I'm, I'm actually really interested. Drop a comment on who you're rooting for in this duel. Not Delta. <laughs> I'm not saying who they think will win. Well, I'm going to have Slifer attack your red gadget. I was about to say, probably not my face down. Hmm. And then afterwards, I'll set a card in. End and my turn. I draw. I like to hit another gold sarcophagus. There's only so many cards that we have that you have in common with other decks. However, you can also take out cards that you do not want to draw. Which might be exactly what I'm doing. This time. All right. I know you're gonna always be keeping track of which monster you can't attack. All right, I am going to just humbly set a monster and end my turn. I'm low on cards, guys. It's easier to deal with a god when you have more cards, but... Slifer will attack. The one that's not Marshmallow. Not Marshmallow? On. I mean, because I'm presuming the first yeah, one is Marshmallow. On. I draw. Not at all what I wanted. All right, I will set one card. Set one monster now. My turn, guys. I have a plan. I promise. That card would help me like five turns ago. Yeah, that's how it usually happens. Slifer, that one. My turn. Yep. Remember, each turn goes by with cards I can't play. Slifer goes up a thousand. All right, points. you know what? It's at five thousand now. I might get set cards I can't play. I'm going to take a huge chance and just pass. All right. I end. I draw. I will set another monster and end my turn. Guys, I'm I can make a really cool play, I promise. With each passing turn, I worry that every other monster you say is also a Marshmallow. That's true, too. I have two in here. I'll just end this card for hand size. I'll draw. Until I can think of a way out for uh, Marshmallow. Alright, I uh, end my turn. <laughs> Guys, sorry if this is getting a little dry. But uh, when one player is and one player is Mushman, that sort of happens. I will set one card and pass. I'll draw. I will set a monster and end my turn at that. Well, 
I said a card. I finally have a way around your marshmallow. So I can shoot you all, mode. all three of your monsters. For the Winged Dragon of Ra, Sphere Mode. Yeah. That was blocked, there man. Go. Go. Yeah, so you didn't get rid of my second marshmallow as well. That's still concerning. But fine. It was worth playing around. Because now with that Sphere Mode, the next turn, I could take the My next turn, I take the Winged Dragon of Ra. Next. I'll reveal my face down. Monster Reborn. Too bad I drew mine already or I could have locked that away in the Sark. To return to me. The Tricky. Alright guys, I guess I've been saying I have a plan. It's your move. Alright guys, first... I will send all three Magnet Warriors from my hand to the graveyard. That is actually happening. We're summoning Valkyrion for real. Valkyrion, the Magna Warrior. Cypher's effect activates. And I activate Magnet Force. This is what happens when you get most of the way through your deck. You are bound to get to these cards. So what do you target? I will redirect the target back to Cypher. Alright, so Slifer loses 2,000 attack. 2,000 attack. And my my Valkyrian is fine. Then, I will use Valkyrian's effect. Sending it to the graveyard. You can tribute this card and target one Alpha, Beta, and Gamma in your graveyard. Special summon those targets. To special summon Beta, Alpha, and Gamma. So Slifer's mouth will target all three of these. And... Two of the attacks will be redirected back to Cypher, and it only is 5,000, so that'll be enough to destroy it. And one of the attacks will be redirected to the Tricky. Well, I activate Tricky Spell 4. Tributing Tricky. Oh. So you give me an equal number of Tricky tokens to your monsters. Uh-oh, guys. I may not have a way to win now. They're in defense mode. But, now I have four monsters to protect myself with. But you do get a 4,000 attack Cypher the next turn. Yeah, uh, 4,000 tag rod, that's what I meant. Well, guys, I will activate Magnet Reverse, targeting one of your machine rock type monsters. The rat is that was sent to your graveyard this turn, which will let me special summon Valkyrian. And, um. Again, so you can check out the Erratus for Magnet Force and Magnet Reverse in our list. Yeah. I mean, then it, I it, will it, attack three tricky tokens, I yeah. guess. And that's actually the best I have. Look at that, guys. I didn't need Magnet Reverse for the, the Magnet Force, but which I left on a field just so you guys could see what was happening. It's till the end of the turn. Um, I will just set that and end my turn. And now, sadly, you get Rob back. Hey, I'll live, though, even if you attack over one of these. All right. I will tribute the Winged Dragon of Ross Sphere Mode. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where's Car Sanctity when you need it? Now would be a great time for Car Sanctity. I dumped my whole hand into that. And Ra has 4,000 attack by default. Yeah, well, what about it? Attack Valkyrian. Interesting choice. I activate Magna Reverse to bring my Valkyrion back. I'm not going to get much more mileage out of it. So I might as well... I mean, I'm not going to get much more mileage out of Magna Reverse. My deck's running very low, so I might as well use on Valkyrion. Hmm. I don't know if I actually have a way around Ra now, though. Well, I'll place two cards face down. And in my turn, I'll draw. Hmm. I'll set a card. I'll switch these three to defense mode. Switch Valkyrion to attack mode. And attack the tricky token. Yep. And I'll end my turn. Guys, wow. I'm like, I'm panicking right now.
I don't have a way around Ra right now, but I have a fairly impressive field. Attack again, Valkyrian. I will take 500 life points. And My turn? Yes. Draw. Well, I'll end my turn. Not what I was looking for. This might just be death by Ra. Wing Dragon of Ra. Attack Beta. There goes my poor, poor Beta. And I end my turn. And I draw. I will tribute Alpha and Gamma for Gandora, the Dragon of Destruction. By paying half of my life points, Gandora will destroy every other card on the field and banish them. And it looks right. like you have no answer. It gains attack for each one times 300, which in this case is at least five. I will be able to wipe you out and end this duel. And guys, there it is. Can you believe it? Gandor is actually the best card in this deck and how you win most of the time. And ooh, that is a painful hand. Guys, can you believe what a game that was? Oh my god. That was pretty amazing. And now, if it, if it only destroyed... And didn't banish? I could have gotten the oh, yeah. Phoenix. Guys, wow, look at that. Guys, like, comment, subscribe. But this isn't to say this will be the only time oh, we do this yeah. duel. Oh, yeah, we could always do it again. I mean, guys, thank you so much. Why'd you end the games out, guys? See you guys.